guys, what's going on? It's your boy Kazel113's Games and More here yet again for another brand new Minecraft video and I am here doing another brand new Minecraft building tutorial. In today's building tutorial I am going to be showing you how to build a simple house. Okay, so um, the area of what you'll need for this house is 10 blocks by 15 blocks so that's how many you need so pretty much you need 10 blocks going this way and then 15 blocks going this way now to build this house um, you can use equally any block well it depends on what sort of blocks you like for houses personally my sort of block for a house would be based around bricks Okay, so we're going to go and get, well, we're not going to make it out of bricks today. We're actually going to build this house out of a mm, white terracotta. So what you want to do is you want to count in one, two, three, four, five. You want to go five blocks in and then on that fifth block you want to place the block. The only reason why is because you want to have like a small like front garden. And now what you want to do is you want to go one, two, three, four, and then you want to miss one and go one, two, three, four. And after that you just want to go like this way, so you want to count this blocks by one, two, three, four, five, six, and then you want this area here to be a back garden area for your house, and then you just want to go then after that just you, you just want to place all these this one and you just want to do this and obviously just build in the rest there now you want to go here you want to count up from this corner you want to go one two three blocks high and then you want to come here and do the same thing and then what you want to do then is you just want to build like that across to there to there so it'll implant a window space and then here you just want to go one, two, so you want to go up, miss two blocks and then place them and you just want to go straight down to there like that. So you should have a, a shape like this. This will be a um, bungalow house as well, so it's a one bedroom house pretty much. And now that you see this, you don't want your doors level with each other, you want to bring this door and put it here guys. So after you've done that, you want to go do this side window, so you just want to do go from that block two blocks cross and then you just want to count six up like that and then you want to do that so it should look something like that now obviously you will have a side window as well here so obviously you just go count up one block count up one block then come here go one two one two one two like that and then you want to go one two three across like that so you should have a window that looks like this then after that you want to come here and place go three blocks high again like that then you want to go one two three blocks across like that now you should have something like this and here you just want to cover the whole of this back rest of this back part up like this like that so it should be like this and then you just want to go count miss two blocks up so you want to go one two and then go like that boom so then you should have something like this and you just want to go one up like that and three blocks high again and then boom something shit then your house should look like this now what you want to do after this guys is you want to get your interior done um so the for interior i would recommend using wood um black concrete and white concrete now the reason why is because where this side is this will be where your kitchen is so it's going to be quite a small kitchen by the way guys so you just want to go like this and you want to go one, so you want to go black, miss one, black, miss one, black. And you want to go here, and then go white, miss one, white, miss one, white. And then you want to come here and go black, 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 like that. And then in between these, you want to go black and black, and then in between all these black blocks now, you want to go white, white, white. And now what you want to do, guys, is grab yourself your wood, and you just want to, you just pretty much want to fill in your um, wood here so you just want to go like just fill the whole area up with wood including your door areas so pretty much here put that there and then here put that there and now the roof okay 
The roof is going to be a little bit similar, so but the roof is going to be made out of completely oak planks. So you just want to get yourself some oak planks and you just want to fill this area in like this. I will show you how to do some lights as well in a minute. So as once as you have the whole of that filled in, what you want to do now is you want to go grab yourself um, some sea lantern and now you want to come here and go like because as you can tell it's like three on three so you want to go one two three like that and you just want to place that there uh three there and then you just want to go meh, and you want to go here and then as you can tell it's a bit tricky here so you just want to go like that and place your lights in like that so it should look like saying one one is in football and now it's time to do your roof now you can do your roof in all kinds of ways but the way how i do my roof is with smooth stone slabs now the reason why is so you can just do this so you just want to build all the way around like this guys pretty much so you should have something that looks like this and then you just want to go on this top bit and go and then you just want to build pretty much simply all the way across the top like this on the top of the house like this guys see it's a pretty simple decent house you could really say you could really say it's a very um nice looking house in a way because at the same time it is a very nice looking house so as once as you've filled in all of that you want to go grab yourself your windows now the windows i would recommend using is um black stained glass panes so pretty much just fill in every window you would like to fill in you can use any kind of glass when you come to building this but i would recommend using black stained glass because look at how more um, textured it looks when you actually use black stained glass but it should look something like this then afterwards you want to pick your door now the door like you've got like all sorts of sections of doors like oak door iron door spruce door birch door jungle door and a cake a sub door and dark oak door now my personally favorite door would be the dark oak because it just makes everything look a lot more nicer in a way so you just want to place them in them areas like that and now after this guys what you can do is well really you don't need this block bit so i'm obviously going to turn this bit here where it says 10 back into grass just so you guys can actually analyze it on like how you want to have it and now here is where the fun bit comes you want to get yourself some any kind of bush it depends on what bushes you like and you just want to go from this area here you want to go one two three four like that and here you want to go so once you get here you want to go one two three four like that miss one and then go one two three four and then you just want to fill in this one two three space and now what you can do here guys uh actually no and then you want to come around to the back and you just want to do the same thing but you, you want to fill the whole thing in in your back garden space so that's how that should look, is a back garden space like this. It's a very looking, it's a nice little bungalow you could say. And now this is where the interesting part comes guys. So what you want to do is you want to grab your butch slabs. I would recommend getting the block version of it though and you just want to, actually wait. And then you just want to add in like um, something like, like a little stepping stone area or something like that. And now what you want to do want to do guys is you want to get your interior and all that done so what you want to do is you want to get yourself a mm, I would say I recommend getting yourself an oak wood open fence we'll put there so it's like a front gate entrance so as long as you've done that we're going to go do your interior part so for interior you're obviously going to need to do your kitchen first so to do your kitchen all you need is a furnace a cauldron um droppers and iron door and block of and block of iron so to do this you want to put your furnace there block there block there um cauldron there block there um block there block there now here you want to 
figure it out. You want to go here and you want to place your two droppers here and then your oak door there. So it's pretty much um, your fridge. So that's how you build your little mini kitchen, I guess, guys. And now what you want to do guys is you want to do your next part of your house. So this is empty at the minute guys. But what you want to go and do guys is you want to go grab yourself a bed. So I would recommend using any kind of bed. I'm going to use the red bed and it's the um, normal version of a bed. And then if you guys want you can add yourself in a little bookshelf for like decoration. And now what you want to do is you want to just make yourself like a mini sofa or something here a little chair or something so to do a little chair all you would want really guys is um where is it ah so you want to come and get yourself um i would say just use red wool and then you just want to get yourself a quartz slab and then you just do this go around like that and boom so guys this is um, how to build yourself a little tiny bungalow like this guys. I hope you enjoyed today's little um, video guys. If you did guys make sure you guys go subscribe to the channel if you are new. Like the video guys and I shall see you all in my next YouTube video guys. Peace out and I hope you do well on your when you watch this building tutorial. Bye guys.